and banks on high alert and fear future Russian cyber attacks. There's behind the scenes prepping for the worst. Again, so I've reporter Lisa Niaves sets the record straight about one rumor that's causing panic. Americans should start taking money out of the bank. That's the rumor going around message boards and social media, according to the Texas Bankers Association. The banking industry is compared to any other is probably got one of the not the highest, if not the highest level of cybersecurity. So the agency did some digging and found no formal authority has given that directive. But regardless, never hurts to have a little cash around. The executive vice president of the association says work is happening behind the scenes to identify any threats. Everyone's acutely aware of cyber warfare and uh, potential threats. The, you, you combine the, uh, the awareness of that through the military sector with the protections and communications with the private sector, we're, we're in pretty good shape. If a cyber attack is detected, he says you, the consumer, will be notified in advance by your bank to give you time to prepare. So we've been sort of holding our breath and kind of waiting for, for the shoe to drop, and it hasn't really dropped yet. Cybersecurity so. experts believe the U.S. likely won't see any retaliation until Russia or Ukraine gains the upper hand. We're not going to see much of anything in the cyber attack domain outside of Ukraine. But once that's settled one way or the other, I think then we're, we're more likely to be in a, a slightly more uh, dangerous situation. Alicia, the big question here, how can we protect our money? The Texas Banker Association recommends for online customers that they check their accounts regularly, look out for any strange emails, and avoid clicking on any suspicious links. Change your passwords often, enable two-factor authentication, turn off your automatic login if you use that, and use the bank's mobile app if possible. Remember, if something doesn't look right, just call the bank. Live north of downtown, Alicia Neyavis, Ken's 5. Thank you, Alicia.